Hey guys, it's Patini Gal, and we are back over in Fishing Planet, and I am with E Loves. <laughs> 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 she, she's here, I promise. Um, but I decided to do some uh, Fishing Planet for the Fourth of July. I don't know, that doesn't nothing really goes with Fourth of July, but fireworks. But you know, it's okay. So um, we're gonna see what we can get. I'm gonna do, I think, let's see. And of course, then my eyes are like starting to sting in water. That's great. All right, so um, we could go to see some of these other lakes, but oh, it looks like they have a discount on the uh, travel cost for the fourth, apparently. Oh man, my eyes are like, no, don't start streaming. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> my eyes don't like me sometimes. So, we have some missions here. Um, we have the Lone Star Exploration 2, which we still need Grass Pickerel and Smouth, Small Mouth Buffalo. And I've been trying. I cannot get those. I don't know what to do. Um, I tried to buy a new... Um, I didn't even get a Kleenex. Um, I tried to buy a new rod and everything, and I, I can't. I can't figure it out. I don't know. <laughs> Hold on. I have a towel I'm trying to dab my eyes with. <clears throat> Probably not going to work very well, but we'll try it. So, um, we can continue with that, or uh, we could try to go to one of these other lakes. Um, we've got the Emerald Lake, um, and then we've got the Emerald Night Challenge, which um, I guess that me with that we need to go to the Emerald Lake and then there's some kind of a night challenge thing to open there. Um, but unfortunately, we don't have enough money for that right now. And let's, let's see if Emerald Lake has a discount on their uh, travel costs. Uh, Emerald Lake. Oh, come on. I want to see. Uh, seventeen fifty instead of three thousand. That's pretty good. <clears throat> let me let me try to wipe my eye again. <laughs> it doesn't ever happen until I go live, like live, live. You know, unmuted and everything. <clears throat> All right. So, unfortunately, we're gonna have to buy another license for um, Emerald Lake because the one I had has been expired for probably a couple days by now but uh, let's see so let's go over to uh, let's go to shop and look at license for New York so for one day it's 400 um, for a basic, for for an advance, it's 900. And I think, let's see. If we go over to the basic, we have to release these trophy fish if we catch them. Um, and the night catch is forbidden, so you have to get the advance to be able to do the night catch. So I think we'll have to do that, and we'll just be able to do the... Uh, one day. I'm still not sure if that's going to give us enough money to actually get there. If not, we may have to go uh, catch some other things someplace else. But let's see. Okay. <laughs> we have, like, barely enough. But let's go ahead and go. Might be a bad idea, but we're going to do it anyways. So we're going to track one of these missions here. Um... To be able to get some of these fish caught. So let's go over to missions real quick. And we'll do... Every kind of pike and sander in Emerald Lake. I don't even know what a sander is. or so, I don't even know if I'm saying that right. But, you know. It's fine. Uh, for the night challenge, we'll have to... Um, let's see. Find the night fish challenge and complete the challenge. Okay. Well, let's do the emerald trail. 
So we'll go ahead and track that one. And I'll go ahead, if anybody wants to join, um, if one of my friends wants to join, I'll make a friends only room. So you guys can come in. Let me know if you uh, try to friend me on Steam and I'll, I'll get you into the room. Okay, and of course it's raining. Sure it is. Uh, I do have some cannonballs, so we can actually shoot the cannon here. I never get rewards. It always says better luck next time. And let's let's raise the flag here. Better luck next time. Why? Come on. All right. So we can try to fish from here real quick and see what happens. <clears throat> All right. So... Oh, I'm using one that I can't actually aim out for. So let's see how this goes. <clears throat> you okay there, he loves? <clears throat> I don't like the rain. Oh, there we go. That happened fast. Let's see, what do we get? Oh, we got a pumpkin seed. That's not what we needed, but okay, we'll take it. So I'm not sure what exactly we're going to be able to catch with this. Um, we'll go into the... What? <laughs> Are you speaking E loves ish again? <clears throat> Alright. No. No. I don't believe you when you say it like that. Alright, so we're going to try this. Oh, you know what we should have done? We're not going to be able to get an, one of our other fishing poles because we don't have it in our inventory. Not gonna do that. Oh, we got another pumpkin seed. All right, we don't want a pumpkin seed. We want something else. So let's go and look at our fish species here and see what we have. So we've got a chain pickerel, um, casting spoons. I think casting spoons is all we have that it'll it'll like. Um, Oh, I think Northern Pike was one of them. So we don't have small minnows and we don't have shiners for bait, but we do have casting spoons. So I'm thinking I may just have to try to fish with the casting spoon and see what happens. And I think this was one of the other ones. Worms, grubs, and narrow spoons. We'll see. Let's look at our inventory to see what fishing rods we've got. So I've got this set up with the telefloat, um, and the second one I think is the other, yeah this is the other pole I bought I think, the value spin 6-3, and this has a um, casting spoon on it. So let's try that and see if we can get anything, anything with this. So uh, one thing I did realize is that... You can actually use the keyboard to um, uh, reel in and um, like lift up your pole. So if you hit enter, it lifts it up, and if you hit uh, space bar, it reels it in. Which is pretty cool. I like that. That sounds confusing. It's not confusing, I promise. <clears throat> it's just fine. <laughs> I mean, this this is pretty confusing if you. Um, haven't, you know, seen anybody play it before, or haven't done any fishing before. Um, actually, I'm going to move my mic down. It's kind of in the way. But, um, it's actually... Then I'm going to have a lot. <laughs> it's, it's actually super addicting. I mean, I play it a lot. When I probably shouldn't, but, you know, it's okay. So I think I'm at, like, level 10 now. Which, Those games that people say are addicting, I get bored extremely fast. <laughs> I know. I know how you are. But we're going to see what we can get here. If Because um, if you can catch fish here, all the fish are pretty good value. Um, and I keep seeing the blue come up on the bars. It keeps making me think I got something. But I don't. Money. Oh. Aw, oh, darn it. I thought I got some. <laughs> no. <laughs> I thought I actually had something on the line. <laughs> All right, let's see. let's see. What are you doing? 
<laughs> I can just hear my dogs fighting downstairs, and it's hilarious. Oh, goodness. Hey, Immortal, how's it going? <clears throat> All right. So, we're going to see if we can catch anything. Hopefully, we can. See, I keep thinking I caught something, but I didn't. I do hear lots of fireworks going off, though. <clears throat> So I think it's hilarious that my dog is like a super chicken dog and everything except for fireworks. He's just fine. He just lays there. But everything else. Can you guys hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Why? Did you not want us to hear you? Oh, I got it. <clears throat> What's up, immortal? I can't hear you now if you're talking. All right, hopefully we get something good. Come on. Okay. Get something that we needed. We got a trophy yellow perch. We didn't need a yellow perch, but we got one. <laughs> I'll take it. Uh, challenge complete. Trophy gainer. Okay, cool. So we got gold for that. I don't like the sound of the rain. It's kind of annoying. But it's all right. We'll do. We'll deal with it. I guess it's better than sound of fireworks if you guys could hear those in the background because they're pretty loud. I was hitting the wrong button. I was hitting to uh, to raise the pole, not actually reel the fish in or the line in. I don't have a fish yet. Fern is <clears throat> going to be a very sad kitty. Why? Because lately we found out that if we give her catnip treats, it mellows her out. Uh-huh. And she likes her catnip treats. Yeah. Well, after her little incident earlier, she's not getting no catnip treats tonight. Uh-oh. What'd she do? She was on my lap, and then out of nowhere, she just jumped up all panicked. Mm-hmm. Got a fish. So and I don't know if she saw something that majorly spooked. I mean, she literally jumped from my lap to the other side of our bedroom. Oh, yeah? Jeez. Well, maybe it was just fireworks. Maybe she heard fireworks. I don't know. <clears throat> you never know about cats. They can hear. They can hear too good. Alright, I really don't like this rain. It's kind of annoying sounding. I mean, it kind of sounds like actual rain. Why can't I throw this out there? Uh, let's see. Can I, can I throw it out? Immortal, you haven't ever gotten on Fishing Planet, have you? Was that a, was that a no? <laughs> All right, let's see. I want to get something other than a perch because I don't need a perch. We probably need to like use something else to fish them or something. I don't know. We don't have the things that it says on the fish species list. Um... Like, we don't have any of the other kind of bait you need. Which probably means I should have waited to come here till later. But, oh well. It's fine. I don't know if I've even looked at what I got from my last uh, level up. So, we might look at that. What? I don't know if my Discord's being a bud or is, if it's just Discord in general. I, I think it's Discord in general. Oh, okay. Oh, I got a fish. Oh, that was super close to me having it caught uh, reeled in already. Ah, another yellow perch. I don't want a yellow perch. Alright, what if we try to aim over here instead? <clears throat> you never know. 
But let me know if I need to change the uh, game sound, if I need to turn it down or something. Because that, that rain noise is a little loud. To me, anyways. Sometimes I think it's loud and then I can't even hear it Like when I watch back my stuff, so I don't know. But we'll see if we can catch one of these guys. Hopefully we can. Oh, here's another one. What'd I get? So, um, yeah, I've been playing this quite a bit. I kind of feel bad because, you know, I'm getting ahead of, um, you know, like Wix and Haley if we stream this, but, uh, but I like it too much. I just, I have to play. All right. I'm not getting anything that I actually need, and I'm not exactly sure what to do for that. <clears throat> My drop frames aren't climbing, but they keep kind of going up. You know, every once in a while I'll look over and they go up a bit. I couldn't actually put my uh, Stardew Valley out because it was too, like, it was too, um, not laggy. I, it would just freeze when I'm talking. It would still go, you know, I could still, you could still hear me, but, um, I was, I was just sitting there doing nothing. So I didn't even put it up. It's still on Twitch, but I didn't bother putting it on YouTube. But the, the Fishing Planet ones I've streamed seem to be okay. Alright, we may not be able to get anything with this one. <laughs> Unless it waits till it's like almost reeled in. Which I kind of like, because then I don't have to fight with the, the fish. I just, you know, keep reeling it in. Keep going down in the reel speed, come on. Alright. So, we'll see what we can get here. I may move over to the other location, actually. See if we get anything different. Uh, Immortal, did you see what I shared in Discord earlier about the game that's free? Right now, anyways. No. It's uh, Overcooked. Um, I have Overcooked 2 on my wish list, but the first one is on sale. And it should be multiplayer, so it's something that we could play on Sundays if uh, people want to want to get it while it's free. Alright, we'll just try to fish off the dock here and see what happens. I hate when it does that. Why am I not finding... Not finding what? All right, we'll see if this works. Because I really want to catch one of these other ones that we actually need. We did catch a trophy fish. That's cool. So, yeah, I totally forgot about the fact that I have three fishing rods, but one of them's going to be in my home storage. So I can't get that until I actually leave this lake, which means we can't use that one. Because if we leave, we have to pay another, what, 1500 to get back here? So, that's not going to work. <clears throat> Alright. Come on, you can do it. Give me a fish. I don't know what technique these fish like best either. Like, stop and go or whatever. But, we'll just do stop and go. See what happens. So, what has everybody been doing for the 4th of July, if you uh, are in the United States at least? Did I get... Oh, I got one. No, nope, I didn't. I thought I got a fish, but I didn't. Well, unless I missed it. Alright, let's see. I'm just going to go out as far as I can this way. See what happens. So yeah, a lot of fishing is just, you know, throwing it out and seeing if it, if anything bites. That's pretty much it. <clears throat> I 
But I like that this game is multiplayer, so you can actually get uh, your friends to play it if, if they want to. And they have some pretty crazy, like, crowded rooms um, in here. Like, you get on, and there's, like, quite a few people. And this game was, was brought out, like, in 2015. So it's, it's a pretty old game compared to, you know, others. But not compared to Minecraft. Minecraft is still older, but <clears throat> you know what I mean. I'll uh, talk to you guys later. All right. Bye, mortal. Later. All right. So we'll see. I think I'll go after I reel this in. I'll go to the shop and see if there's any kind of different bait we can get. Because, um, like I said, I don't think there is. But I did level up recently, and I don't think I really looked to see what what new stuff we were able to get. But we'll see. We'll just reel it in here. Okay, let's go to the shop real quick. Uh, shop. There we go. Let's see if we can turn that down. Uh, audio. Uh, interface sounds? I'm not sure. But we'll turn that down a little bit. Music will just turn down to 14. Maybe that'll be good. I don't know. Turn that down a little bit. Oh, we can turn on float fishing bite sound. Not sure if I want to do that. Okay. We'll try that see what happens. So, let's look at the bait real quick. Oh, we do have small minnows. Oh, we do have new stuff. We have shiners and small minnows. Uh, the only problem is the small minnows are 450, and we don't have that much. And the, sh the, the small minnows are 450, and the shiners are 7 gold. And I only have 9. I don't know if I want to spend gold on that. Well, we don't have any, <laughs> we don't have any money we can use. That's not good. And all of my options here are just trash whatever's in the backpack. So that's not going to work either. Let's use our patriotic walker. That seems like a good thing to use today. I don't know if it's going to give us anything. And honestly, I don't know how to use this. Because if we throw this out... Um, let's see. If we throw this out, like, right there. And do that. Uh, it just kind of stays on the surface so I'm not exactly sure I'm like well what are we supposed to do with this I don't know but and it always has like a a, a little bit of stuff going on at the bottom of the bars which usually means a fish so I'm not exactly sure I think this is just one that you like reel in really slow maybe but it, like, never moves from the surface of the water. It's really weird. I don't know what to do with that. But we can reel it in slowly and see if it brings anything. And we can stop every once in a while. Because, I mean, I guess it just goes across the surface and just kind of acts like, I don't know, a, a fly or something on the surface of the water. Don't know. But I thought it was worth a try, worth worth a shot since we're you know, since this is Fourth of July, might as well do the patriotic walker, right? That's moving. I saw that move a little bit. I think. Not sure. But I mean, it still shows the blue on the bottom of the bar, so I'm not quite sure. <laughs> not quite sure what this means. Unless we can use this as um, some other kind of fishing, you know, option or whatever. I kind of just drag it like that. But again, yeah, I don't know. Don't know what this is used for.
So if it like moved a little bit, you know, if a fish bit onto it, that would be that would be helpful. Or if the um, if the stuff on the bottom of the bar, you know, got got a lot bigger, like the the blue section got a lot bigger. But I don't know how else to fish with this. So let's reel it in. And I'm just going to throw it uh, as far as we can out that way. If we can't, yeah, that don't work. I don't know why sometimes the cast just doesn't work. Not exactly sure why that is. But nope, still don't work. <laughs> All right, I don't get it. All right, I'm going to do something real fast. Actually, I can't do it real fast, can I? I was going to move my webcam because it's right over the uh, names of the fish that it's wanting me to catch. So, we'll see how this works. I don't know if there's a way that you can change, uh, that you can, like, lock these together. That would be super helpful. Because then I could move both the webcam and the... Um, the border together and I, I don't know if there's a way to do that let's lock that so I don't move it okay it's being it's being a pain the only way I can actually choose the camera overlay um, is to just click on it and use the arrow buttons which I don't necessarily like but that's that's how it is so we'll go ahead and move it down. And uh, let's go to webcam. And let me know if this doesn't look right once I get it set up. Because it's kind of a pain to get it to look exactly right. To me that looks good, but I'm looking at it really small. So I could be totally wrong. <laughs> there we go. All right, so let's do this. Let's go ahead and let's try this barbless nano. I don't think this was in any of the options for the fish, but I'm going to try it anyways. Because this was, I think, our last um, reward for getting uh, one of the missions done. So we'll just try it and see how it goes. <clears throat> see what happens. I'm getting some blue on the bars, but I'm not sure if that means the fish is already going for it or what. So we'll see how this goes. It can't go wrong, right? It'd be super awesome if we could get one of the fish that we actually need. <clears throat> but again, we should have uh, saved up some more money before we came back. That's my bad. See, sometimes it acts like there's a bite, but it's just like it gets stuck or something. Oh, now it's going back to one. <clears throat> All right, let's see how this goes. You don't have much line left to bring in, but that's usually when I end up getting a bite is like right at the end. See, like that. I could have sworn that was a bite. That's so annoying. All right, we'll try that one more time. Because I thought that was a bite, but I guess either it wasn't or I just didn't click on the right spot. So let's do that. I knew that wasn't going to work. I knew it. All right, we'll go out like that. There we go. All right, we'll let it sink down most of the way until I, before I uh, start reeling it in. I don't like to make it, make it go all the way down to the bottom just because I'm afraid it's going to, like, snag on something. I don't know if it works that way, but, you know. No. Oh, man. How did I not? 
hit that. Oh well. It didn't get stuck, so we're good. So let's just see how this goes. Almost got all the way to the bottom. I don't know why I'm having such a problem hitting. I'm hitting the space bar. It shouldn't be that big of a deal, but apparently it is. You'd think being in the rain that the fish would bite more because they uh, see this stuff at the surface of the water and think it's like dinner. Maybe not, but if we fast forward, um, we're going to run out of our day uh, license pretty quickly. So I hate to do that. But I may have to switch to another kind of tackle because I don't know if this one's necessarily getting going to get used at all. I'm like going to get any fish excited. If there's any in here at least. They're probably all like down at the bottom like nope I'm not coming up there. Alright let's see. May put the uh, casting spoon back on. So at least that uh, one of the fish said casting spoon on the on the stuff so that's probably not gonna be a bad idea. But we'll see. So, um, I used to go fishing with my grandpa. Um, I think I mentioned this, uh, before when I was playing, but, uh, I wasn't really fishing as much as like he would, he would bait my line and throw it out and then just give me the pole to, to uh, hold on to. And then, you know, if I got something, he would let me reel it in a little bit, but he would finish and then take it off. And, you know, I didn't ever handle the fish that that was. No, that was just not, not going to be me, but, uh, I still liked fishing with him. I mean, it was always fun, but, and even though all he did was, you know, pretty much help me, he, he liked it too. So it was always a good time. <clears throat> all right. So I think I'll go ahead. Let's see. I mean, this is a spinner bait, so it should be okay. But we'll go ahead and switch back over to the casting spoon uh, after I bring this in. And this one may be more of a sit at the bottom and wait, you know, kind of thing. But I, I don't know. I would have to actually, like, Google a barbless nano spinner just to see what it does. I'm not going to do that. <clears throat> All right. So let's just do the casting spoon. And there are bigger casting spoons we can get, but I don't know if that's necessarily um, going to be helpful. So we'll just, we'll use the casting spoon again and see if maybe we can get something that we need. <clears throat> Unfortunately, like I said, we can't get any of the uh, baits because even if we um, got some fish that cost some pretty good amount of money here, we have to leave before we can actually get the money. So I'm not exactly sure how else we could get it. Other than, like I said, selling something, but it doesn't give that as an option for anything. Oh, there we go. We got something. I'm going to make sure I'm actually reeling it in so all I'm doing is uh, right is uh, right clicking every once in a while just to make sure the fish is coming this way and if it ever gets too tight on the line I'll have to let the drag out a little bit but this seems to be not a bad not a bad fish hopefully it's something we need please be something we need I want to catch something new all right. It looks like probably something we already have. I think. There we go. Yep. A perch. Again. <laughs> I mean, not that I mind getting perch, but 
I want to get something else. Something that we need. All right. Let's see if this is going to do us any good. Because I think we fished over here with the other one. I don't think we fished over here with this casting spoon yet. So we'll just let it sink down a little ways. And then... I don't know, like, which technique is better for which fish. But I'm just going to do what I can and see what happens. Seems to be the best, best option. <clears throat> but... Um, we'll see what happens. Uh, I could just leave it at the bottom for a second, but I don't want to leave it too long because I'm afraid it's going to get snagged, like I said. I don't want it to get snagged. See, I don't know what that lift and drop is. I'm not exactly sure what that does. And I thought that was one that you, like, right-clicked. I don't know. Could be wrong. Like, I'm right-clicking and le left-clicking at the same time. But that doesn't really seem to be doing a whole lot. So it's fine. We'll just reel it. Just reel it in. Oh, see, every once in a while, it looks like I got a fish. I don't know what that is, but it looks like a fish on the line to me, and then it, then it isn't. It's kind of annoying, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and throw it out here again. <clears throat> we need a grass pickler, which to me means it's found mainly closer to the grass. I mean, that seems like seems like a thing, right? But I haven't caught any yet, like here or at the, um, uh, I thought I got one, yay. Or at the um, Lone Star Lake, I couldn't remember the name. Um, but yeah, so we'll see, we'll see what happens. I know last time I was like, you know, just yanking the line around like crazy. But this is really, I think all you have to do is just keep, uh, when it gets a little away from you, right click and kind of lift the pole up a little bit. And that kind of changes, changes the direction of the fish. Oh, we got something. Yay, grass pickerel. We got it. Awesome. So that gets us one. <laughs> we still need four. But but we got one. Hey, I'm I'm happy. Um, let's just try to go, oops, no, not that close. Let's try to go over here. Um, I accidentally let, oh man, I guess I keep right clicking and letting it go, but that's okay. We'll go ahead and try for more along the grass area here. Just to see, maybe that'll get us some more stuff. I don't know. You got us a grass pickerel, but... You know, that's, oh, here's another one. That's one fish, anyways. One fish out of four and bad. Like I said, if we had the money for it, you know, we could get, like, some minnows and stuff like that. I just, I honestly didn't think I had any, um, any minnows. Like, I didn't think I got any of those. No, come back. Is this going to help or hurt? Okay, it is just going away from me. And I don't know what to do when the fish start going away from you like that. Because I kept get happen having this happen last time. And it might, may have been off stream. Oh, don't, don't do that. Ah, darn it. Uh, but yeah, I would... I mean, I guess I need to increase my drag so it gives them more line, but that seems, it seems like it would just make it worse. Did I loot? I lost it. Okay, I think we can get a casting spoon pretty, pretty easily. So, let's go back. Um, we've got a casting spoon. Red and white. I don't want to get the red and white. It's only two gold. Um, but where's the actual casting spoon we had? We have slop spoons. I don't know what that does. When fishing in thick cover in aquatic weeds, you can use a slop grandpa spoon to get a fish strike. This spoon consists of a smaller cup spoon with a single 
hook and a weed guard molded into the spoon. Um, try twitching and pausing or let the spoon settle. Or make a straight retrieve over and through the cover. I kind of like that idea. A spoon can be qu quite effective while catching fish in heavily weeded areas. Um, what are narrow spoons? Much thinner and lighter. The most significant advantage is that their shape allows to make a retrieve at any speed from a desirable depth. It's a good choice for fishing fast moving streams and rivers. Okay. So... I kind of want to get this just because it's red and white. Uh, have a distinctive back and forth wobble. Um, the simplest way to fish a spoon is to cast it to the desired depth and then make a retrieve by wobbling it back in. A steady retrieve at slow, medium pace is preferable. Okay, so I'm going to get one of these. And I'm going to get... I don't know what the difference of the gra the gold or the silver is. I don't think there's a difference. Doesn't look like it. I'm gonna get the silver. Oh, I can't. It's 150. All right. Well, we can't do that. So <laughs> let's go back into our uh, inventory here. Let's do casting spoon. See what happens. Okay. Like I said, we got one. Out of five of them, so we still need four more. I knew that wasn't going to work. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping we can get this. Because if not, I just have to leave and spend that money again to get back. And I really don't want to do that. Because that's a lot of money to have to spend to uh, get into this lake. But we'll see what happens. So if we just let it go to the bottom pretty much and then just kind of do a stop and go, see what happens here. Hopefully it'll get a fish. I don't know how I keep missing the space bar. It's like a, the, the longest key on the keyboard. How am I missing it? But I am. All right, let's see. I thought that was a fish there for a second. It was just kind of a lag spot spike there. <clears throat> All right. So let's see. Can we reel it in and get a fish? I'm hoping we can get a fish. Because, yeah, I probably should have fished somewhere else to get more money so I could have money. You know, money's always good. Especially when you need, like, certain baits and stuff. So I'd really like to get some minnows. Because I think that would help. I mean, obviously, I'm not exactly sure. But I would have to, uh, like, Google stuff for that. And I don't like Googling during stream. It's just weird. <clears throat> I don't like Googling during videos either. So it's just like, you know, I watch videos while I'm doing other things to kind of see how other people do what they do and uh, then I use that. <clears throat> Alright. <clears throat> Let's see how this goes. Wait, is that... Was that a fish already? Because that seemed like it was going out before I was even doing anything. Unless I just accidentally had my hand on the space bar. That'd be kind of weird. I accidentally uh, use the space bar when lately I just don't get the space bar when I'm supposed to. It's just weird. Just weird. All right. So let's see if we can get anything. I was hoping this would help us. Unless maybe I'm just not doing the uh, retrieval method right. Which is definitely possible. Because <clears throat> you guys know me. I'm, I'm not a... I'm not a pro fisher fisherwoman. Why do I keep doing that? Alright, so... After this, I'm going to take a quick drink. Because I'm kind of thirsty. 
The only problem with this is you have to keep an eye on your on all your stuff to make sure you're not, you know, missing a fish. So it's kind of hard to uh, do other things <laughs> while you're fishing, which, I mean, is true in real life, too, I guess. But, you know. All right. <clears throat> so we could try the bobber and see if we can get anything, but I, I knew that didn't work. I knew it. Let's reel this back in and let's see. Because I don't think any of these other fish said anything about baits as far as like... Of course, a lot of the ones from the Lone Star Lake didn't say anything about um, red worms. But it seemed like red worms got pretty much everything. Like this is preferred lures as worms. Um, and see, if we had small minnows, that would probably help out a lot. I would love to get a pike. Because those look like pretty cool. But these may be what keeps trying to bite that we just can't get can't get in. Um, let me see. If we go to shop. Yeah, we only have 138. Just looking to see what other kinds of things we can get. Um, baits. I mean, we can get some minnows, but that's all, that only gives us 10 for 7 gold. And we are already down to 7 gold. So, I don't really want to do that. I would like to get small cut bait, too. But, let's change back to this one. And let's see. Oh, I don't have any. Let's see. How, many, how much was the red worm? 75... Uh, think twice if you see the current purchase, you will have no money. Okay. Um, uh, so let's not do that. Let's just do with what we got here. I'm just going to go ahead and throw this out. We'll see what happens. But this one is one that we can't aim. So it's one of the reasons I got the other pole that I did is because you can use a bobber, but you can still aim it. Um, which I think is the one that is in my home storage. So, oh, I keep accidentally. See, I either don't hit the space bar at all or I accidentally hit it like all the time. What the heck? I don't like it. Well, let's see if we can get anything. Um, I don't know if I've actually been in this game very long with it raining. It seems kind of weird. But, oh well. It's fine. So, I don't have any red worms. That's usually what I would use. I just have pet food and cheese. Um, which, obviously, it didn't say any of them like either pet food or cheese. So, so I'm kind of worried we won't be able to catch anything with this. Oh, here's something. Let's see if this works. Okay. Let's see if we can reel this in and get something. Nope, pumpkin seed. That's what we keep catching with this, and I don't like it. I'm going to actually go to... Oh, no, stop it. I'm going to actually go to this one. And... I don't think we can put this on. Can we? Let's see. I think this one is the one I mainly just lose all the time. Why am I not clicking on this? Okay. We'll see. But I think this one you have to actually have a jig, like, hook, like a jig head. Um, I could be wrong, but I think so. I just want to see if we maybe catch something with this. Uh, those fireworks are getting loud. Like, out here, because uh, I live, you know, I live outside the city. So, um, if, we, if you go out on the patio, you can, like, pretty much see fireworks all around. Um, which I usually do. Um, I usually go out and do that. But the last couple of years, I've just been, you know 
kind of like, I don't want to, I don't want to race around trying to find where the fireworks are coming from. I don't feel like it. So I just, instead of racing around outside, I just, uh, go channel surfing until I find it. <laughs> but I just went ahead and recorded, recorded, um, the Macy's, um, the Macy's fireworks celebration. So we'll see. Most of that is just, um, is, uh, entertaining, like the song, the music and stuff before the fireworks. And then I think they said there's like a 25 minute fireworks show and then that's the end. So we'll see how it goes. I went ahead and recorded it to watch after I'm done here, but, um, you know, it's, I used to go see the fireworks with my, with my grandparents and, uh, Although it's been a long time, I don't remember a ton about it, but uh, I do remember always being afraid that, like, one of the sparks from the fireworks was going to, like, land somewhere and set things on fire. I was always paranoid about that. All right. That did not work. So, let's see. Let's go over here. Why is this not working? There we go. Uh -oh. All right, I would really like it if it would stop raining. <laughs> like, honestly. Can I sleep and, you know, the rain will go away? Is that a thing? I don't think that's a thing in this game. Uh, why aren't I going faster? I need to bring up the real speed a little bit. So the cool thing is, if you are using the space bar to reel, you can actually just let your hand... Um, you know, you can use the scroll, the scroll button or the right mouse button instead of having to concentrate on uh, keeping your finger on the left. So I kind of like that. Because when I have to keep my finger on the left mouse button, I'm always worried. I'm like, I can't change my, my real speed because I can't get my finger off. <laughs> I can't take my finger off the mouse. So it's nice. It's nice to have another option. All right. I don't think this one's doing any good. We'll try one more. Oh, that, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, I threw it anyways. Okay. You never know what it's going to do. But, oh, well, it's fine. Maybe it did that because it knows that this is the way I need to throw it. You never know. It could happen. <coughs> It could definitely happen, but, uh, see, what's weird is even though, there, I know there's no fish on there, but if you look, you know, once you start reeling it in, it brings up, you know, the little blue, uh, things on the bottom of the bar, so I keep thinking, well, maybe that is a fish, but you have to wait until you get a little bit more on the bar than that. I was just way too close to the surface, okay. Well, I think we got, what did we get with that other one? I think it was the casting spoon. Unfortunately, the one we had, we don't have anymore, but we'll use this and see how this does. Um, I wonder if we go this way. If we can go, like, over here and uh, see if we can get anything. I knew that didn't work. I went too far over. So if you go too far uh, past the bar or you don't go far enough you uh it doesn't it doesn't cast it it's kind of weird that's how it is let's go ahead and see if this works should i let it sit or i don't know i mean we could let it go down and sit on the bottom and then bring it up a little bit i mean that's a uh, stop and go it's not the best like use of stop and go I don't think because it only gives you the one the one circle instead of two or three but um you never know I mean I don't think the fish would like the the fish that um are just hanging around at the bottom of the the place you know let's see what does it get ah uh, yellow perch again 
See, I don't mind. I mean, it's fish, but come on. I want to. I want the stuff that we actually need. <clears throat> Can we get the stuff we actually need, please? Like, I don't know. Anything that we actually need? Why won't this work for me? I must be leaning my hand on the space bar or something. I don't know what's going on. But it's okay. So we'll just kind of uh, cast out into different spots just to see if we can catch anything. And I don't know what to do with those fish that like, it seems like they just want to take the line and go with it. And I, do, I don't want them to do that. Because, you know, I kind of want to catch them. So not quite sure what to do with that. But hopefully, hopefully we'll get something that we don't have already. But I really think it's that pike that is doing that, that's reeling it, that's, you know, making our line go all the way out. Maybe we can get this guy. I definitely don't think it's the pike. Or what we tried last time, because it is, uh... Coming in fairly easy. Oh, we got something. We get chain pickerel. Okay, cool. I like it. So we're getting there. We're getting there slowly but surely. Not what I wanted to do. Okay. So we just gotta kind of flung it into random random place there. That's all right. As long as we you randomly catch stuff, we're good. This is where we're supposed to look for the old Washington, uh, what was it, old George Washington statue or whatever. But I was told it, it's where you have to actually use a boat to get to, which we don't have money to use a boat. So I don't know exactly what we could do there. And we'll have to leave before we can get any money from this trip. So that's not going to work either. Unless there's another way. Unless there's another way to get the money without actually leaving. Because um, that would be nice. I would like to do that. Let's see. Um, we need a northern pike, a redfin pickerel, and a... I don't know, I don't know how to say that. Sauger? See, every time during... Like at that last reel in, it looks like I got a fish on, but I don't kind of weird all right can I do that thank you yeah it must be that I'm this that I have my my hand on the space bar by accident I'm just gonna oh I wanted to stop there not there oh well that's fine <clears throat> I'm afraid I'm going to get snagged like right when I try to reel this in, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. All right. So can we get some something else? We need three more. Three more kinds of fish. If I could get the three, I would be super excited. Oh, and I don't know how to do the night fishing thing either. Probably look at that. It's only 757, so to do the night fishing, we'll have to, like, fast forward time. So I don't really want to do that until we get to a point that we have to, you know, until we have the other stuff and we can fast forward. Because technically that's a different uh, mission too. So we don't want to... I want to do that too early. But we obviously do want to do that while we're here. We only have a day. And I think that's a day in game. The um, actual license that you buy is in a day in that in a real life day. So it's a little bit different. But we'll, we'll see. 
I hate when it stops like that because I keep thinking it's a fish. Nope, oh, it's not a fish. All right. <clears throat> Go ahead and do right out there. Oh, I didn't click it in time. No, that is not what I wanted to click. It's being weird. All right, let's try this again. There we go. All right. <clears throat> so I'm happy. We've caught we've caught a we've caught quite a few fish. I mean, only a couple that we actually needed for the um for the uh mission, but Oh, I was doing it the wrong way. <laughs> it's fine. Hopefully it won't get too crazy on us. Please don't start reeling out the line like that. Oh, did I get it? Okay. As long as you don't start going back out, we're good. Oh, we got something else we needed. <gasps> Yay! A red fin pickerel. Ah, oh, I don't have any more room. Oh, that stinks. Okay. Before we do anything else, let's make sure. Let's go to our fish keeper. And, um, let's see. I want to maybe throw away the ones that don't give us as much, uh, money so we can keep the ones that do. Let's go ahead and just get rid of those and then we'll see if we can catch the other two we need. <clears throat> this is going good. This is a good fishing trip. Need a northern, see it's the northern pike I'm worried about. I'm worried that those are going to be too, too heavy for us. Because I'm pretty sure that's the one that uh, likes to run away with my line. And uh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Because if it runs away with our line, then we either end up with a broken something or uh, we just don't get the fish. So... Either way, not good. Not good at all. So, let's see what we can get. I mean, if we get another one of the ones we already have, it's not a bad deal. I mean, it still gets us XP and uh, gold. Uh, but Or not gold, but money. Um, see, again, it happened... Uh, I could have sworn that was a fish. <clears throat> so, it's told when it stops, that's when you need to... And that's when you have a fish on there, but it doesn't seem to always be the case. Like right then, I could have sworn that was fish, but it wasn't. Oh well, we'll go ahead and reel it all the way in. And uh, let's go ahead and kind of fish to over here. Oh, not there. Over here. I'm just not letting go of this thing. Why? Duh. I let go of it too soon. Okay. How about if we do over here? Oh, I totally forgot to click on it. That is not what I wanted. I know it was an unsuccessful cast. I get it. Alright, I'm just going to try to kind of throw it out here. I know it's pretty close, but I don't want it to get snagged. I'm afraid it's going to get snagged. That is going down the bottom really fast, though. I don't know if that's really a good thing or not. I don't think that's going to work. I think that's too close. All right, let's go ahead and try for something like over there. So it's not too bad of a fishing day, I would I would say. It's only 8.17, so we got time, right? We can always uh, fast forward, like I said, if we need to. We'll uh, look at the peak fishing times and maybe fast forward in a second. I don't want to fast forward too soon because 
I want to make sure we don't run out of the day um, that we paid for. But I really think the uh, pike is the one that's like running off with our line. All right. I could have sworn we had a fish on there one time, but okay. Let's try and go out here again. <clears throat> See what happens. I I think it was around. It was out here that we got that one bite that. Um, wanted to take our line so we'll see if this uh, works <clears throat> all right so I'm just gonna try to use the keyboard see what happens like I said we hit enter to uh, like set the hook to you know bring the reel up and then we just hit spacebar to reel in I've been using spacebar to reel works pretty good but we'll see. We'll just not get any kind of a bite now that I'm all set. <clears throat> Alright, let's see. I just need two more fishies. Well, two more kinds of fishies. You know what I mean. But we can definitely look at the, you know, prime fishing times to uh, maybe fast forward to you. Because I know last time I streamed, uh, Rusty Ice came in and told me to uh, fast forward to 9 p.m. So we may do that. And then we could also look at the uh, night fishing thing. But I think that had like 10 fish on it. Like it was crazy. <clears throat> but let's look real quick. Go ahead and exit out of there. The map. Yeah, so there's not really a huge difference in between all these times. I'd probably say 7 to 9. Although, I don't know if I want to fast forward or not. That's the problem. Um, I guess we can. Uh, so let's go ahead and hit T. And we'll go to... See, it has a cooldown for next uh, fast forward. It kind of goes up as you go throughout the day. I'm going to actually do... Wait, there's no cooldown period from 9 p.m. until 5 a.m. I'm going to actually do 7. We'll do 7 o'clock. And see if that helps at all. And then when it gets night, we'll... Um, Probably should have done a little bit later, but when it gets night, we'll try to do the night challenge and see if that helps at all. I don't know if the rain's helping at all is the, is the thing, but I can't really do anything about the rain unless you can like stop it, but I, I doubt it. I bet you just have to let the day go through. I mean, there's not usually a day that it rains all day long you know, from sun up to sundown, but I guess there's not really an easy way to mimic that in the game. Unless you can sleep the night away and let it stop raining. That scared me. My, my finger slipped off, off the space bar and made a noise, and I was like, wait, what was that? <clears throat> All right. Let's see if we can catch anything here. The problem is, I, I know we should have uh, brought more bait and stuff, but we don't have it, so we're just going to have to do with what we got. And <laughs> have our fingers stop slipping off the space bar. That would be good. But it's okay. I mean, that's, that's half the fun of fishing, is just sitting and waiting. See, wasn't that a fish? That seemed like a fish. I mean, that made a lot of splashing for not being a fish. Or maybe it's just the bobber thing I have on. Or the, not the bobber, but the uh, spoon. Maybe that made the noise. 
All right, so we'll throw it out over there. I know this is where we caught one of them, but this is a different time of day, so we'll see. We'll see if it works at all. Too bad you can't just have the time go faster. Like you can't just have it go double time or something like that. That would be nice. I don't know how fast it does go, but usually when I'm playing, I'm like, really? It's it's only been like 10 minutes. Are you sure? <clears throat> but yeah, has its own little time frame, I guess. Because the only thing that seems to work like in real time is, um, what the heck? Is, uh, the, when you buy a license, it actually does the real day real life day see why does it keep looking like I have something on the the pole I don't get it or on the line you know what I mean not on the actual pole uh, or rod or whatever <laughs> I think it's called raw rod in this game but I call it a pole I call it a, I call it a fishing pole That's just what I've always called it. And I think, like, in Stardew Valley, it's fishing rod. And I can never I can never get that right. Just because I don't say fishing rod in, in real life. I say fishing pole. But, oh well. I guess everybody has their own way of saying things, right? <clears throat> so, let's try to get this in and see... We may go over to the other spot just to see if we can, like, I don't know, cast from a different direction. But we'll see. Because we're still pretty much uh, casting out into the same area. So I don't know if that really works. I wish there was another, um, another location here. But there's just two. And they're pretty close to each other, so it's kind of weird. Do you think at least if there was two, they would be like on opposite sides of the of the lake? But oh well, they didn't ask me, so I didn't get any say in it. <clears throat> Plus, I I wouldn't have known about them in 2015 because I didn't have a PC and I didn't stream or do YouTube. So yeah, I started YouTube. Well, actually, I started Twitch first. I think I started in. Uh, no, don't do that. In uh, 2016. And then pretty soon I started uh, YouTube. So it was like, you know, I like the Twitch because Twitch is fun. You get the immediate, you know, immediate interaction with your with the viewers and uh, you get to chat and all that. Um, but YouTube, you get to uh, just go in and see, I don't know if I should. No, I'm not going to fish from there. Let's just fish from here. Uh, but on YouTube, you just get the, you know, you can get the comments afterwards, but, um, they're both fun. Um, you know, Twitch takes, takes a lot of work, but it's a different kind of work than YouTube. YouTube is more of a, you know, you gotta prepare, you gotta record, you gotta get it all uploaded, you know, Twitch, you just got, you gotta be there at the time and, and stream and then you're done. But I also, you know, I also uh, put my stuff up on YouTube, so I've got to do that to you. But <laughs> I have fun with it. I have fun with it. Sometimes it's a little bit, a little bit crazy. But uh, you know, I'm not, I'm not super good at um, what's the word? Um, like, in, is it self initiating or I, I can't think of the word. But uh, I'm not super good at coming up with a schedule, you know, when I when I need to do something, and I'm like, I'll just get up and do it when I when I get to my computer. <laughs> That's pretty much how I am. But I do have my scheduled like multiplayer stuff, but you know, kind of have to do that. So if you guys aren't following me on YouTube, definitely check it out. <laughs> And these uh, Twitch streams are on YouTube a couple days later. So, 
If you want to check them out afterwards, definitely do that. Okay, I didn't get anything there. Maybe seven wasn't a good idea. Maybe I should have fast forwarded to nine, but oh well. It's fine. We can see what we can do. Like I said, I wish you could make it where the time went faster, but it's already 730. And uh, it seems to have gone pretty fast, so we're good. And I don't know how long I'll be streaming um, since I started later than I normally do. Uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. I would kind of like to get this mission done. And then maybe the uh, night fishing. And uh, then we'll see. Or, or not. You never know. But hopefully I can get these other two fish. Uh, I'm going to look at them again. It's the Northern Pike and the, I want to say Sauger. So, I don't know. I've never seen that kind of fish before, so I don't know. Well, that name anyways. See, why does it keep looking like I got a fish on there? Does it get stuck or, see, look, like that. I'm not exactly sure what's going on there. See, I d that, like, makes me think there was a fish. What if I just put it, like, right here? <laughs> Can I catch something, like, right here? No, I'm not going to try that. All right, let's see. I know I was going to look at my, uh, at those fish fish species, but I guess I can just see. I can let it go down. See if I get anything right here. I don't think I will. It looks like it's doing something down there. But it might just be the, uh, the, like, movement of the water. Yeah, because that looks like more like the moving of the water kind of thing. So I'm not going to do that. All right, so we need a northern, <coughs> northern pike and a sauger. No, stop. I want to look at... Stop it. <laughs> I keep clicking to, to uh, cast. I don't want to do that. All right, so let's see. I would like it if it would say, like, what time these fish would uh, bite. So I need northern pike. Does it say anything? Uh, let me oh, what does this go? Okay. But the average length is about 100. Average weight is 2 to 8, which is 4 to 17 pounds. To, uh, prefer to stay in heavy cover, waiting to, uh, waiting to ambush. So, I mean, I'm guessing, like, someplace in here. And maybe they, maybe night more than anything. I knew I was going to do that. All right, please don't lose the hook. Okay. It was released. We'll see if it stays that way. All right, let's see. That's why I don't like to fish in those because I never know um, if it's going to get snagged and I don't want to lose my stuff. Especially when I don't have money to buy other stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's not going to work. All right. Where else is there, like, heavy cover? I mean, I'm afraid I'm going to... afraid I'm going to get... Stuck. <coughs> I can't stop coughing. Jeez. So I don't like to fish over here because I'm, I'm afraid I'm going to get stuck. And I think the movement of it is just because the movement of the water is so close to the shore. But I'm trying to think because if northern pike are more like uh, hide in the cover... See, again, I thought there was a fish. I thought there was a fish on it. I don't know what's going on with that, but okay. 
We'll just go ahead and reel it in. All right, let's see. Oh, I, I didn't want to throw, okay. <laughs> hey, uh, yes, I am on PC. This is a PC game, it's free, and um, it's super fun. At least I like it. I mean, I'm not really sure about all the, uh, you know, specifications about what fish, you know, wants what and what time of day to, to catch them and all that. I'm, I'm not that kind of a, that kind of a fisher person, but, uh, but yeah, I like it. I think it's super addicting actually. Uh, no, no, stop. I keep doing that. I know it's an unsuccessful pass. I didn't mean to. I knew that was going to come and it was, it still, it still scared me. <laughs> that noise. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Um, I think it's the, the Seeger. Is that right? I think that's right. How are you doing tonight? All right. Let me go to, to the live thing. Okay. So, um... See, these, this is pretty good money. Get a bunch of free fish if you press alt, alt 14. No, I don't want free fish. I want to, I want to get my own fish. Let's see. So if the, um, what was it? The pike, uh, if they like cover and they like to ambush stuff from cover, you'd think that right here would be good. Cause there's cover like right over here. Um, but I don't know. Let's see. Unfortunately, my drop frames are getting a little bit bigger now, but hopefully it's not too bad. <clears throat> All right. So hopefully I don't get snagged on this stuff, but we'll see. Cause I really do want to get a Northern Pike and then the Sauger. I'm not sure. Or it gives you a bonus. Okay. Let's see. Um, we'll just do the stop and go down at the bottom. See if we get anything. Um, I really do think the Northern Pike, though, is what uh, keeps trying to take our line. And what eventually breaks it. So I don't really want to do that. But we need to get the Northern Pike. So... I may not be able to finish this mission in this one because um, I may have to go out so I can make that money and then be able to get like minnows or something. Uh, here's something. <clears throat> we'll see what this is. Probably not a pike, but let's see. Nope. Grass pickerel. All right. <clears throat> Yeah, because it wasn't, it wasn't hard to do, like, the, uh, like, the one that, that likes to steal our, our line, which I really think is the, uh, pike, and I don't know what to do about that. Maybe, maybe just in increase the drag so they get more line, but then it's going to take even longer to, uh, reel it in, so not exactly sure on that one, but we'll see. So, do you play on um, on the PC? Or do you play on um, the Xbox? Or, I think it was it the PS. I, I think the PlayStation does it. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know where else you can play this game. <clears throat> but yeah, it's definitely a good game for being free. I mean, there's so much stuff you can do. Yep. Awesome. <clears throat> well, Ian, this is on Steam, so if you want to friend me on Steam, you can join this uh, this room for tonight, and because um, I I created a friend's room, so if you want to, uh, you can do that. I am not getting anything right here. See, I don't know why it <laughs> why does it look like you you catch fish when there's nothing there. I don't, I don't like it. It's like it just wants to taunt me. Like, you got a fish, you got a fish. No, you don't. Just kidding. All right. Well, we caught what? Like 
three of the five we needed, so that's, that's not bad. But I do want to catch the other two. I just, I didn't look at the um, one for the other fish. This sauger, I don't know. I can't. Come on, let go of the space bar. Okay. So, um, let's see. We'll see what happens um, here. We may go back to the dock, but like I said, I don't know if there's like too much difference between fishing here and fishing off the dock just because they're so close to each other that, uh, you know, it just, it doesn't seem like it's that big of a deal. And now my nose is itching. Oh, no. All right. Let's see. We'll see if this is going to work. Whoa. <laughs> see that? It just like sunk down to the bottom super fast. That was a little weird. Unless it was just the lag, but not exactly sure. But sometimes I really do think it's just like trying to get catch me off guard. Um, okay, I'm not going to say that name, but thank you for the follow. <laughs> not exactly sure. That's a lot of E's and Y's and T's in that. <laughs> All right, so let's see what we can do here. And it is getting super loud with fireworks outside. Unfortunately, I can't see anything from my my room because it's so dark. But uh, and so all I can really see is the reflection of my my room. So <laughs> unfortunately, that doesn't really work. Um, I guess we'll go back over to the dock just to see if maybe there's a, another place we can fish from. I don't know, because I think if we follow this, it's just like a dead end, I think. Unless, I, come back and see if there's another, oh. I was like, what is that telling me? But it's just telling me to come back tomorrow. Okay, so that's a dead end, I figured. And then, this is probably a dead end over here, too. Because I don't think there's any place else we can get to the water. Yeah, I think this just dead ends right here. Can we go that way? Nope. All right. I don't like the invisible wall kind of thing. It, it's kind of annoying. <laughs> I'm like, if you don't want me to go there, just put like some sort of a barrier right there that I can actually see. That would be nice. I, I would like that a lot. Some of these places seem like you may be able to fish them, but uh, fish on them, but you have to go through all this. So I don't know if that's a good idea. I don't think it would be a good idea, but I could be wrong. And like I said, we can't afford to rent any of the boats or canoes, so they might be on sale right now, but I don't have I don't have enough money for any kind of sell anyways. <clears throat> so we'll just have to see what happens. And my nose will not stop itching. Jeez. Alright. Come on, fishies, you can do it. We just need two more. Two more kinds and we're good. <clears throat> I don't think it's going to happen. I don't know. Kind of skeptical at this point. Um, okay. So let's see. We're going to just go ahead and get this in here. So we can reel out to pretty, uh, pretty long uh, line length. So that's good. I mean... So we don't have to go too far. But we still can't. I mean, I would like to get further out. But we need a longer line for that. So let's see what happens here. What if I just go slow and do this? Like go to one. And then just bring it up that way. I don't think any fish is going to go for that, huh? Uh, that's fine. All right. So we could go for a different kind of um, bait, maybe. Oh, my gosh. That is so loud. So loud. Okay. So what do you think we should do for the bait? Okay. <clears throat> uh, 
There we go. <clears throat> okay. All right. Uh, <coughs> let me get a drink of water. I cannot stop coughing. There we go. Let's do this. <clears throat> we got quite a few fish. The grass pickerel actually looks pretty long. Um, I don't know if it's as long as the uh, pike. But, oh, that reminds me. I want to go look at the fish species. And let's see. We need this one. Uh, no, I, I clicked on the northern pike. I thought. There we go. Northern pike prefer to stay in heavy cover waiting to ambush. Yeah, I knew that. And we need um, this one. This looks like a weird fish. Um, small minnows, worms, grubs, and narrow spoons are the preferred lure lures. What is that? I never can say that. Lures, right? Lures? Anyways. So, let's see. We'll look at, at these. I'm going to say it again. I can't say that word. Uh, minnows. Can we? No. Uh, worms. So, the narrow purple one. Okay. Thank you for the follow. Uh, is it Mon Monster Mum? I think that's what it was. Uh, farm the muskies at night. Um, well, I'm trying to get the, uh, the, uh, two, what was it? The Northern Pike and the... Uh, this one, the Sauger, Sa Sauger, I don't know, I don't know how to say that, but, uh, so I want to get those, <laughs> so I try to figure out, and I don't have any money, so I can't spend any money on getting more, uh, baits and stuff, so that's kind of my problem, um, I'll show you what I'm doing, what I'm using right now, is this, uh, value spend 6-3, the mini spin, 1,200. The mono, um, 0 0.007. And the casting spoon. Um, and the casting spoon's been pretty good uh, for me this time. So I may have to let something go, though, because I still haven't got... I'm going to go ahead and let the lesser um, money ones go. Just so I can make sure to have enough room for other things. But, uh... But yeah, one of these missions um, over here is the Emerald Knight Challenge. And I have to catch 10, I guess. 10 fish is what it means. So I don't know if that's going to happen. But that's what I need to do there. And then I've got one of these. I haven't... Uh, quit jig oh, I don't have a jig jig bait or anything like that. So yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. I know. I it, I made a mistake. I, I came to the lake and I spent all my money to come here. And yeah, it's wasn't a good idea, but I'm trying to get what I can out of it while I'm here at least. Um, how much is? Oh, I thought maybe I thought maybe they would have those on sale right now. But oh well, I'm just I I've been pretty good. I mean I've caught oh I I did that way too early. Um I've caught quite a few. Uh I just not I need two more. Um and I don't think I can get the pike. Like I think the pike is one the one that keeps um yeah I got a license. Um the pike is the one that keeps you know taking all my line and then eventually I I break it instead of getting anything. So I'm pretty sure that's the one. I got the advance license so I could keep any trophies that I ended up getting, if I did. I did get one. I did get one trophy. So, I think it was worth it. But, yeah, I I probably shouldn't have come to the lake, but I did. There's another lake I need to go to, but it costs about the same... Well, I don't know what the license costs, but it costs about the same to travel to as this one. 
And it's on sale, I guess, for Independence Day sale or something. So it's pretty cool. It's like fifteen hundred instead of three thousand. So it's not bad. But yeah, I'm not exactly sure if I'm doing the right thing to get the right fish is the problem. So like here I get a fish, but if it's let's see if I can get it in fairly easy. Yeah, I don't think this is the one that I had all the problem with because this one seems to be coming in pretty, pretty easy. Hopefully. Now that I say that, it's like, nope, I'm going to go out here. I think it'll be okay. Let's see, what is this guy? Come on. Uh, not what we need, a personal record, but... Uh, no shame in grinding Texas. I did it for a while. Yeah, and I, I did go ahead and buy the advanced unlimited license in Texas. So, uh, so yeah, I can definitely go do that. But I just, while I'm here, I didn't want to, I didn't want to waste the, uh, license I got. So, you know, I, I wanted to go ahead and see what I could get. But yeah, the, the problem is I have another fishing rod or pole or whatever, whatever you want to call it. I have another one of those, but it's in my home storage, so I can't get it until I leave. Um, unless there's something else I'm not thinking of. Um, I think the only way you can, you can do it is go. This map here changed the game for me. Yeah. See, I haven't ever gotten... Um, I came here the other day and got some walleyes. And they were like $200 each. I'm like, oh my gosh, this is so cool. But yeah, I was like, do I even have the stuff that I need to come to this lake? I don't know. Um, so yeah, the walleyes are, are pretty good. But uh, I may need some better better gear. Um, I did get a bigger fish net, um, which, which works out pretty good. I don't know if I need to get a get a stringer or not, but I did get a bigger fish, uh, fish keeper. And, um, I, I like I said, I did buy another, re uh, another rod, but I, I brought, I think I brought the wrong one and left the other one in my home inventory. Why does it look like I get fish every once in a while and there's nothing there? I don't like it. <clears throat> I use this singer uh, it's 100 pounds. Oh, wow. That's cool. Yeah, I haven't got a, a stringer. I just got the, uh, the fish keeper because I thought, yeah, this sounds like a good idea. <laughs> I'm nowhere near, you know, the, the kind of fisherman that, like, the fisher person, anyways, that, uh, I know, like, what fish needs what and all that, but I still am super addicted to it. <clears throat> I mean, you know, it doesn't take long. Yeah. Yeah, I just need to get some more money. Uh, I was trying to catch... What was I... Oh, I'm still doing the um, Lone Star e Exploration 2 mission. Um, but there's a couple of fish that I can't catch on there. And I don't know... I don't know why. But, uh, yeah, we may leave. I mean, I don't even know if I could finish the night one. Because you need to catch 10 fish. I think that's what it looks like to me. Um... So I'm not sure. I may just need to, to leave. I don't know. <clears throat> but we're, I was just going to see if we could catch anything else while we were here. And I know it said the northern pike, uh, they like to hide in the cover and then kind of ambush their prey. So I was trying to fish near like the lily pads or the tall grass, but that doesn't seem to be to be working either so I'm not sure I have a bobber and you know bait I can use but I don't have a lot of bait they're up the right side okay well like I said I think I've caught one or two of them but they just like they just swim away with my with my line in their mouth and I finally just break every something in the middle of the leaves on my left okay well, let's go ahead and reel this in. Um, I'm going to go ahead and go over this way. If I can let, let go when I get there. 
kind of random. Okay. Why can I not let go? Come on. There we go. I just, I'm just afraid I'll get snagged if I go over here. So I, I try to kind of let it, let it go to the bottom and not, but not too far. So it doesn't get snagged anywhere. <laughs> of course, I don't know if that even makes a difference, but that's what I do. <clears throat> so, yeah, it's, uh, I mean, I know fishing is all about, you know, it's all pretty random. You know, you throw your line out and, and hope you catch something, right? But, uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. But we may go, we may end up just going to Lone Star. Can I break your line because it's low level? Yeah, I know. That's what I'm worried about. <laughs> but, because that's what I kept having happen is it would break my line. And I've got some other line, but every time I try to put it on one of the, one of the rods, it says it's like too strong and may cause damage or whatever. So, another yellow perch. Which is not bad, but it's not what we need either. Um, yeah, I don't know. Do I just need to uh, bring the drag up when I catch something like that so it has more line to play with? Let's go back out like over here. If I can. And... Uh, Let's see. I'm going to go ahead. Uh, bring your drag as high up as you can. Okay. See, is that a fish or is that just like snagging on something? I don't like when it does that because it likes, it likes to psych me out there. I'll bring my drag up if I get a fish on, I think. Isn't that the best thing to do? Or do I, do I go ahead and bring it up now? Uh, don't, yeah, I know. I try not to, uh, but I, I let go of everything and it, it's too late. It already did it. <laughs> okay. That's what I figured. <clears throat> I don't remember where I was when I actually caught the one that ran away with my line, but I want to say I was close over there on the right side, but I could have also been on the left near that, near those lily pads. So we'll try it over there too. <clears throat> I'm probably not going to be streaming for too much longer, but we'll see. I really did want to get done with this mission before before I stop streaming, but I also have stuff I need to do before I go to bed. <clears throat> but yeah, we'll see. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and reel it, reel it in all the way. Yay, it stopped raining. Awesome. <laughs> I like it. All right, let's go ahead and re uh, throw it out over here. I know it might get snagged on the lily pads. I'm kind of worried about that, but we'll go ahead and reel it, reel it in a little bit. Yeah, now it's getting dark. Yeah. I got snagged. Okay, come on. You can do it. I don't want to break it. Give me. <laughs> Hold on. I don't want to break it. Stop it. No. Okay. I thought it broke. <laughs> it's like, no. All right, let's bring the drag down again. <clears throat> uh, I was breaking because I had some long battles with muskets. Yeah. I bet. See, the only problem with fishing at night, especially when you're doing it on stream, is that it's hard to see. So, I don't necessarily like to do that. See, did I, accident did I accidentally catch something on the end uh, with that snag? Yep, I did. Okay. Discard. I don't need any water lilies. I don't know. Do any of those actually help with anything? Emerald junk catcher. Okay. Well, I got got gold. That's that's not bad. Um, let's go ahead and just put it out. Why can I just let go? <clears throat> All right. Let's do right there. 
Ah, darn it. Every time I got a new map, I watch. Yeah, I I watch. Um, I think his name is Alex M. He does a lot of tutorial series, but uh, my problem is there's just so much information, you know. Unless I'm like sitting at my computer, and I can, you know, kind of keep up with them in the in game. But I usually watch it when I'm away from my computer. So by the time I get back, I just it's, it's hard to remember all that. So yeah, I definitely know what you mean though. <clears throat> But I was hoping I could catch at least one of one of these other fish. But I know you said the sauger or however you say that. <laughs> Probably saying that totally wrong. Um, it maxes the speed. Oh, okay. Uh, I know that you said that one is um, random. So I'm thinking that's just uh, eventually you might catch it kind of thing. <laughs> I do like the soft raining though. That is very good. Okay. So let's see how this goes. So far we haven't got a bite that I've noticed anyways. Yeah, but I was trying to remember where we got that bite before. That was the one that just ran off. Um... Because if the pike uh, hide in cover, we don't want to, like, fish out here for him because that would be weird. So, let's just go ahead and try to fish over here again. But, yeah, as it gets, as it gets more, you know, as it gets darker and everything, it's just super hard to see for me and even probably harder for you guys to see over the, over the internet because, you know. That, that's a little bit harder to see the videos once they're going through the internet and all that. So, All right, let's see if we can get anything with this one. If not, the walleyes come out at night. Anywhere in the middle, you hit them. Okay. Yeah, I was doing pretty good on walleyes. The only problem is I have quite a big... Um, well, although the walleyes give you a lot more money, I guess I can just release some of the some of the lower ones. Because, yeah, I didn't want to waste my day here um, and just leave. So I wanted to go ahead and get whatever fishing I could done. I don't remember when the day ends. Is it 5 a.m. or is it sooner than that? Or is it like midnight? It might be midnight. I mean, obviously, that's when... The day usually starts. Uh, 5 a.m.? Okay. That's what I thought. Because I know, I, I think it was when I was here last time. And all of a sudden it said I had finished my day. And it, I think it was like 5 a.m. So I just kind of fished here until I couldn't anymore. And I was like, alright, we're good. Uh, I did have a mini bass jig. I don't know if that uh, is any good for walleyes. Here's the mini bass jig I have. And then I have the barbless. Uh, I can use the barbless. I think that's what I was using last time. We'll see. It. We'll see if this works. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, but okay. Seriously, I cast it just fine. See, I wasn't sure how to use the walker because it, it was like I couldn't figure out what I had to do with it and when I actually would get fish on I don't think I ever had a fish on it, but um, I, I couldn't figure it out because it just stayed on the surface and it always showed like the blue down at the bottom of the bar, so I wasn't quite sure what to look for. But I can try that next. Is that, hold on, my nose is itching, sorry. Um, is that uh, one that you just reel in, like, um, slow and get a fish if it wants to bite? <laughs> I guess technically you could do the stop and go with it. You just don't have, I don't think it shows up like this is doing. I could be wrong. Oh, there we go. 
I keep pushing the wrong button. I keep right clicking instead of just left clicking to reel it in. Let's see, what did I get? See, this is going out with the line again too. Is it too bad? Uh, I think it's okay. Maybe. Nope. Okay. No, no, no. Stop. Ah. See? That's what happens. <sighs> I don't let go in time or I do something wrong. I don't know. See, that was probably a pike. <laughs> uh, you put on one speed. I clicked on real time. Okay. Yeah, I know. I was trying to... Uh, I don't know. I was trying to do something. I don't know what I was doing. We've got another barbless, um, or what did you say? The walker? You want me to use, uh, let's see. So let's go ahead and make, we'll put the, uh, drag halfway. <clears throat> so I don't know how to use this one. You put on one speed. Oh, I clicked it wrong. Hold on. On one speed, right click, uh, then reel the line tight. Okay. We'll try it. Because a lot of these I have to pretty much just kind of play with until I realize how to actually do it. Uh, let's, I want to get, nope, not, not that. There we go. Okay. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. All right. So just kind of reel it in slowly. See what happens. All right. Yeah, I think I have to be just slower on the reeling in when I get to, you know, fish like that. But I just get, um, oh, right click then reel. Okay. But I just get uh, a little crazy. Oh, now we're walking. Okay, cool. Um, I just get a little um, excited. So do I keep right clicking or do I just do that like once? Because now we're walking, so I guess I can just leave it like that. Don't reel. Oh, okay. I was thinking you just uh, slowly reeled it in. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and throw it out again. Um, don't, you said don't reel unless you right click. Not exactly sure. I'm kind of confused on how to do that. Because do I stop? Oh, okay. I'll definitely have to look into that one. <clears throat> yeah, I've never, I was like, I don't know how to use this walking thing. What's, what's the deal? Okay. So, uh, yeah, I thought this would be a nice, uh, one to use. Then real the, oh, okay. Gotcha. <clears throat> because uh, of it being 4th of July and everything, I thought the Patriot uh, Walker would be a, a good one to use. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it, it gets me a little confused because it shows the, the blue down at the bottom of the, uh, of the bars. And that's what I'm used to seeing, like, when there's a fish. Okay, I'll definitely have to try that. I'm not getting anything right now, but I may be doing it wrong. Or not realizing that there's a fish. Oops, too, too, too far. Yeah, I'll definitely have to try that.
It's a bit wrong. I'm going to see. Um, let's go back here. Is there any kind of bait I should use on this to get a fish from here? Or should I just use the one I can actually cast out? Yeah, I'm sure. It, it always takes me a while to finally figure out, like, how I'm supposed to be, you know, using it and all that. But it works eventually. <laughs> and I have this glowing pear-shaped float that I got from one of the quests or one of the missions. Um, you never use the bottom. Oh, okay. Uh, and I don't know, because it shows a moon, so should we maybe try this? I, I don't know, because it is nighttime. But I'm not sure. You never used one here, so I can try it just to see. Because the, the problem with this is you can't do a, um, you can't cast it out. So, I mean, you can't, you know, aim cast it. So I'm not exactly sure if that's even going to work. I do like the little glowy thing, though. That's kind of cool. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll try it. I mean, try something. Try something once at least. See see what happens. I think last time I, I did use one of these bobbers here. And I think... What did I kept? I kept catching something, and I can't remember what it was. <clears throat> Right click for what? It's not doing anything right now, so I don't want to right click yet. Oh, no, no. I It won't let me. I've tried uh, right clicking with this one, and uh, it won't let me. Because this is... I don't, I don't think this is a casting rod is the problem. I think that's... I think that's it. I don't know. I've tried right clicking. I'll try it again. Uh, I don't think anything's going to bite this, though. Sometimes I just move it around to see if something's going to gonna get interested in it. But, uh, but yeah, so... It's definitely one where I try to watch people play this that know what they're doing. Uh, target. Yeah, I do it on the other rod. It just doesn't... I, I've never been able to get it, uh, get it to work with this one. I'm going to reel this in real quick. So, because I'm right-clicking and it won't do anything. But if I move to my other rod, I can I can right-click and, and aim. Do I have to do the F11 on it? Because I think I already did that. Why wouldn't it let me go back over? Hold on. Oh. There we go. Let's see. Oh, there we go. Thanks. <laughs> I thought I had that part turned on, but I guess not. All right. Thank you. I thought I had that on, but I guess it changed it sometime. Because, <laughs> yeah, I was showing my friend how you could do that. And, uh... I thought it was still on, but guess not. Yeah, everything, everything's good. But I don't think anything likes this bait. <laughs> and I only have one other bait for now because I don't have the stuff to get anymore, which kind of stinks. But I learned my lesson. I'm not going to come back here unless I've got a lot more money. And I check my uh, inventory before I go. Yeah, I'll get the hang of it. I I get a little, um, or I get pretty, uh, I don't want to say obsessed with it, but I play it for quite a while, and then I'll just, you know, off stream and uh, just have some fun, see what I can catch. But yeah, I don't learn, I don't uh, actually focus on, okay, what fish am I catching and what bait am I using and what hooks? It's just, it's a lot of information. <laughs> So, I don't think we're going to catch anything with this here. Let's go back to, um, so I'd like to at least catch, like, one walleye. That would be nice. Before I'm, you know, done with the, the day. I could try to go to the, um, 
night mode thing, but I'm just not sure. I don't think I'll be any good at it right now. How? <clears throat> All right, so let's go back to inventory. So should we stick with this um, walker or should we go back to either the barbless narrow or the casting spoon? Walker in a Mudwater video. Yeah, I'll have to look it up. I'll have to look that one up because uh, it's a little confusing. I don't know. Maybe I'm just making it confusing. I do that a lot. <laughs> but uh, you can uh, send it, uh, send a link to me on twi Twitter uh, if you want to do that. My uh, Twitter panel is down there. And actually, I've also got this. I think this will work. Let's see if I can get this, get this to work. There we go. There's all my social media information there. And I've also got... I think I've got a couple of these. <laughs> uh, you can just search. Yeah, yeah, I can search for it. I was just letting you know if you wanted to send it to me. Alright. <clears throat> yeah, because I do a lot of searching for... If I'm at a certain place in Fishing Planet, I'll search for that. Uh, I'm going to see if I can go back to the casting <coughs> the casting spoon. See what I get here. I do that like that glowing one, though. And it's only obviously going to work. Well, I mean, it'll work, but it's only going to look cool at night. Um, and just because of the um, viewing of it, I really like to fish during the day instead because you can actually see what you're doing. It's not too dark. I mean, uh, last time I I fished here in the dark, it seemed to be a lot darker than it is right now. It's only 10 p.m., so I guess maybe it's because it was like 1 or 2 a.m. Maybe that's why. Because as the, as the night goes, it gets a lot darker, I'm sure. Unless it just depends on like if it's overcast or not. Uh, you get a hat with a light and then... Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. Do you get 100 fish, like, in total, I'm guessing? Or do you have to have 100 fish on you? Because, <clears throat> yeah, I'm definitely far from having 100 fish on me at one time. Uh... Oh, in total night fish? Oh, okay. So I'd have to come back here or another place. Well, I guess you can do night fishing anywhere, right? Or no? Because I know this has a license for night fishing. I went ahead and bought the one that, that had the night fishing. Uh, as an option. The advanced one. I think the advanced ones are better options if you can get it. Just because the advanced ones let you keep some of the, like, trophy-sized fish you catch and all that. It's a lot less, if any, restrictions. Yeah. Yeah, I've done that. Um, I mean, I went from, you know, 8 in the morning to uh, about 7 p.m. And uh, then there's a cool down. But it says it's not, that there's not a cool down at night, which is pretty cool. So yeah, I can do the uh, fast forward if I want. I just wasn't, I wasn't wanting to fast forward through this day since it's the only day I have at this lake, but I can fast forward now that I'm not getting anything. Um, or I can just leave and go back to uh, Lone Star. Why is that going so weird? I guess I must be letting go of space bar or something. I'm not sure, but, uh, but yeah. Yeah, I don't like that you can't do anything when you have the rod cast. Like, you can't go anywhere. You can't hit T. You can't hit I, you know. I can see that you can't hit T because you can't fast forward while you have your rod cast, but. Oh, well. It's not like in Stardew Valley where you hear the little noise 
when uh, you get a fish. I think you can, like, I think something, it may have been a mission I did already that gives you a bell, but I don't really want to use a bell. That seems like cheating. I mean, I, I guess I could just to, just to make sure I don't miss anything, you know, when I'm doing, like, off stream, just hanging around and, and fishing, but I don't know. It still seems like cheating to me. Okay, I'm not catching anything. There's a bell on the bottom rod once you get a stand. Oh, okay. Yeah, I knew there was some... I, I knew I saw something about a bell. But I think what I'll do... I'll do this last catch. Uh, this last... Um, you know what? It's cast is what I meant. And then we'll go back to Lone Star. I'll show you the fish that I don't have um, from that from that mission. I was hoping to get this mission done, but it doesn't look like that's going to happen. And if I leave, obviously I can't come back unless I pay another $1,500. Right now it's $1,500. Usually it's $3,000. I've seen some people with those stands. It looks pretty cool. But I keep spending my money when I get it, you know, just like in real life. If I have money, I don't have it for very often, <clears throat> uh, very long, because I'm, I'm like, oh, I got money now. I can, I can get stuff. That's how it works. <clears throat> All right, yeah, we're, I don't think we're going to get anything. I don't remember what I used last time for the walleye. Um, but I was... I didn't catch a ton. I think I only caught like three, uh, maybe four, while I was streaming. I tried to catch some more after stream, and it didn't work. Yeah, I've got I've got the um, a bigger fish keeper um, that you know lets you have a uh, I think it's a bigger max size fish and also a bigger you know uh, fish capacity. So. Don't remember which one I got. I'll have to look. Yeah, I think I'm done here. <laughs> All right. Uh, we'll go ahead and go. <clears throat> I mean, I can fast forward to another time, but I think we'll just go and uh, see what else we can do. Because we've got this one. Uh, we just need to finish that, and that gives us a, a shad. 8.8-pound um, fish net is still small. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Um, I didn't want to get too crazy. I mean, I was just seeing what I could buy. So if we go to... Which one is that under? No. Wait. No. Uh, am I not seeing it, or... I know it's here, so I hate equipment. There we go. Keep net. Oh, now I... Can I not buy another one? I don't know. Alright, let's go to map. Um, there's tricks you can do as well when you're reeling in. Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure there's a lot of stuff you can do that I haven't thought of. We're going to go ahead and go. I don't want to stay here anymore. We got 474 and a 298 XP. Not bad. <clears throat> YouTube, it will become... Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so I don't want to repair anything just yet. I'm good. It shows 1750 right now for Emerald Lake. I thought it was... Hmm. I thought it was cheaper than that. Just a minute ago. Or, you know, when I came in here. Oh, well. So, we'll just travel to uh, Lone Star. Since it doesn't cost anything. Uh, we'll go this way. I don't know if it really matters, but <laughs> we'll go this way. Yeah, I like watching YouTube. Um, I just, I haven't... It hasn't sunk in. Like, all the information I've been watching hasn't really sunk in. I watch some every once in a while. And, uh, I, I don't like being in the... 
room with a ton of other people. Especially because I don't know, like, what they're going to do in chat. So I want to keep it friends only. <clears throat> it's because that, that seems safer that way. And it's a lot less people. So um, we'll try to just fish right here and see what happens. Uh, let me go to the mission uh, I've been on. For the missions, Lone Star 2. So we need a grass pickerel and a smallmouth buffalo, which it's funny because the grass pickerel I got there at Emerald Lake. So that happened. <laughs> um, private service is a time saver as well. Yeah. Well, I do um, the friends only just in case people uh, like my mods and stuff like that want to join me. Um then uh, I've already got the room. Come on, I don't want to break anything. <clears throat> All right, let's. I don't want to break anything. Just oh my goodness. <laughs> I don't want to get up there in the red. I think I'm gonna have to break it. Come on. I've been having pretty good luck with just. You know, being able to get it un unsnagged pretty easy. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Right now. Come on. Yeah, it's not working. <laughs> May just have to break it. Oh, well, it would help if I did, did a, that. Yeah, I, I didn't realize that. <laughs> Come on. Well, my friend Haley, who's streamed this with me before, she's, she's had a hard time with the snags. She doesn't, uh, she doesn't usually get out of them. She usually just has to break the line. Which, I can bring the drag up again, but uh, you can alt F4 as well. Just have to reload the game. Oh, yeah. Um, I don't really want to have to reload the game. I can just break it. I mean, I think we've got more stuff, and we've got some money now. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just going to break it. <laughs> I'm just going to break it. It's fine. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. So, how much money do we have? We only have 612, but it's more than we had. So, Oh, I should have gone to the home storage to show you what I got. Uh, saved a lot of lures like that. Yeah, I'm sure. Um Let's see. And I think here I was mainly doing the bobbers, but were we, was that the casting spoon we used? I don't remember. Let's try this. And yeah, it's getting kind of late. I'll probably go ahead and end pretty quick. But I mean, I would like to finish this um, mission because it's, I've had it for quite a while. Oh, that went down fast. I didn't expect that to go down so fast. I can try the walker, um, but I may just have to have time to figure out how to use that exactly. So we'll see if this gives us anything. <clears throat> the grass pickerel, I don't remember where I got that. I think I think I was just aiming towards the like tall grass area. And finally got one. Of course, that may be it may have been a coincidence, but it seems like, you know, the, with the name Grass Pickerel, you you would find it near the grass, right? Of course, then again, you have the problem of uh, getting stuck. Oh, that went way too high. Because uh, now I want to get stuck. Well, we'll just try to cast out one more time. 
Now, obviously, I'll probably be, you know, playing some in between just to try to get this done. But I kind of feel bad because I'm playing this uh, with a couple of other people sometimes on Sundays. And I think we played it on a uh, last Thursday, too. Can't remember. But uh, they're definitely not the level I am. And I, I kind of feel bad for that. But I'm just super addicted to this game. So, you know. Some people don't want to just sit here and, and fish, you know, in a game, but I like it. I think it's fun. This seems to be going down to the bottom really fast. Does it just weigh a super amount? But I don't know. It just seems to go down there pretty fast. I'm going to try the walker real quick and then I'm going to get off here just to see if something happens. <clears throat> oh, oh, I forgot to, sorry. I forgot to bring it down after I, uh, after I broke the line. Uh, let's do that. And also, I'm going to bring the drag down. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me about, about that, because, yeah, I did not, I did not even think about that. Right, let's see what happens here. Actually, no, let me go down to one. There we go. Yeah, I forget to look at the speed sometimes in the drag. I'm like, I knew that. I promise I did. It still seems to go pretty fast, but well, it's at one, so not quite sure. But yeah, I'll, I'll definitely have to um, try with this because I, I don't know. Oh, I was like, what happened to it? <laughs> All right. But yeah, I think I'm going to end it here. Um, I will be streaming again um, Sunday with, uh, with Haley and Wix and Cozy and whoever decides to... Um, to stream that day, but uh, we always have fun. Uh, Mudwater video, the guy uses the walker. Okay. Oh, Mudwater. This isn't Mudwater. This is a Lone Star. Okay. All right. I'll figure it out eventually. I promise. <laughs> yeah, you did. Thanks so much for hanging out in, in chat. I appreciate it. And, um, and yeah, hopefully, hopefully uh, watching me try to fish when I don't know what I'm doing is, is entertaining for you guys. But, uh, yeah, I do want to say thank you for hanging out. Um, uh, like I said, I will be streaming on Sunday. And then I always stream Monday, Thursday, and Sunday. So at 8 uh, Central most time, most of the time. Today was different being 4th of July. I hung out and had some good food and then came down. So, so yeah, usually 8 Central. Um, and so keep an eye on that. And I will I'll try to put on Twitter... Uh, when I know what I'm doing, so you guys will know. And, uh, yeah, you take care, too. Thanks a lot. And uh, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!